Welcome to Loopland. Let's learn about the times loop. The times loop repeats code for you. Isn't that cool? Use it when the monkey will be repeating the same actions over and over again. This is how you write the times loop. First, you have to decide how many times you want to loop your code. And whatever number that is, you put it in for x. Period the word times, space, dash, greater than sign. You see how the dash greater than sign looks like an arrow? And then underneath, you put all the commands you'd like to loop on. Make sure you indent those commands, and you do that by using the tab key on your keyboard, or you can use four spaces. Let's look at the times loop in action. Here's a challenge that probably looks familiar to you. We want the monkey to collect these three bananas, and it looks like there's a sort of pattern here. But if we were to code it sequentially, we would, let's see, what do we want the monkey to do first? We want the monkey to turn left and then step 15. That gets us to the first banana. Next, we would turn left again and step 15. That gets us to the second one, and then we'll turn left and step 15 to get to that last banana. Okay, let's make sure this works. Okay, it works, but we want to use a loop instead. So, um, let's see, we've We've repeated the turn left step 15 three times. So what we could do is just have one occurrence of that pattern and put that one occurrence into a times loop. Okay, by default, it's giving us the three, which is exactly what we want. Um, but if we wanted to loop, let's say five times, we would just change that to a five but we want it to loop three times. Now, you see how the turn left is indented, but the step 15 isn't? What would happen if we did that, if we just ran the code like that? Ah, the monkey turned, the monkey turned left three times and then ran the step 15. Now, sometimes you want code like that. You want to have a loop, and then you want to do something afterwards, and that's how you would do it. But in this case, we want to do both of those commands in the loop. So I want both commands indented. So now if I run it, it will turn left in step 15 three times. Very good. And we get our three stars. Yay. Okay, very nice. So that's the times loop. Now it's your turn to use the times loop. Good luck.